Hello lovey doveys I am MC here. Today I'm going to show you how to get a custom subscribe button in your videos so that it's not the normal note or annotation that you would use in YouTube. So what I did was I just simply googled subscribe button free and there's a lot here that you can choose from. Um, you know some aren't free even though it says free some aren't free so what you'll need to do is you'll need to click on some and you know make sure that they're royalty free like for instance let's see um i like this one it's cute right free icons png so this is free you know what what you're gonna want to do scratch that let's do something else and it will work out better let's go to the link where this is at okay there we go and let's see, let's do open image and new tab, and it should come up bigger. Um, however, it doesn't give us enough room there. So let's go back here, um, whether it be small. So uh, shift command four on a Mac is the screenshot, and that should be big enough. Now the problem is uh, it does not have a transparent background. So what we're gonna do, Okay, so now there we go. All right. So this is what we want to do. Delete. There we go. Select all. It's still there. Let's do save and let's navigate back to the desktop and there we go. Okay, that's the one. There we go. All right, so... Now you can see you can see the whole thing, um, but it is still cut away. So let's double check and make sure that the picture in picture shows the full thing, and it does. Okay, so at this point, um, let's double click on that. Let's make it a little bit bigger, and where should we put it? Here, here. Let's just let's kind of put it hovering over there. Okay, so now it's just a picture. Um, there's really nothing that you you can't make a link or anything at this point invalid username and log and see it does that how cute is that you don't have to do that uh, make it animate uh, where did it go uh, that's dissolve zoom swap uh, I think if you put it to zero it won't do anything okay um, you can do a shadow too which is fun and so yeah oh it still does that hmm you know I haven't figured out see it still does it <sighs> so anyways whatever it's still cute and it's still animated let's make it a little bit longer let's make it through the transition it's invalid username and there it goes it. okay from there is just go Boom. over to okay my so what you're going to do obviously you're going to save it you're going to upload it yada 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 now because i can't show you real time um wh how that works because this video is already uploaded Let's go ahead and go to my video manager and I will give you an idea um, of how this could work. So uh, let me see this newest, the newest one that I've done. Edit. All right. Let's go where the annotations are. Okay. Because what you're going to need to do oh, now is you're going to need to annotize it. Now, what you're going to want to do, though, is you're going to want to do a spotlight. Okay. Which doesn't show up. I mean, it, it has a little gray around it. Oh, that's the text. And then we want nothing okay see so there's nothing there so for instance let's go let's go to an image for instance that maybe i put on there that you want to make your custom link to be okay let's pretend where it says minecraft at the top is the subscribe button that you used okay okay so stop it where it is okay now you're going to want to do this spotlight bring it over to start where you want it uh, we got to find it. Okay. First make it an outline so you can do that. Okay. So what you do is you just drag it around the image now because it's transparent, it could be big so that <laughs> anywhere they click on the screen will do it. Even though they're clicking on the image, it could be, you know, whatever, but it has to be in a rectangular square, um, shape. So then now uh, let's play just so we can see it and we want to remove it when the image disappears okay so it disappears there let's go ahead and drag that there then what we're gonna want to do is go back to there we make the outline transparent 
Now you physically can't see it, right? So let's just drag it back here and see how it works. There you go, you can't see it. But if it said subscribe here, what you do is you make it a link, you make it subscribe, and there is a super tricky trick about how to get the exact subscribe link. You don't just have to link it to your username or your channel. There is a special code that you add to the end that will take it directly as soon as you click on it to subscribe, okay? The subscribe box. Um, I will add that special link in the description. If you want more in depth and showing you literally from step to step me creating um, a custom logo, I mean, a, creating a custom button, um, which I will actually release for download for anybody who may want it. Um, I also can create different versions and options for you if you want for basically free. Um, you can message me, um, leave a comment. My email address uh, will be in the video as well. You can any anytime message me there. Uh, hit me up on any of my social sites. Um, and yeah, so that's it, lovey dovey puddin' puggies. I hope this helps you figure out how to make cool custom subscribe buttons instead of just the normal annotations that you have.